Hi, I'm Benjamin Garrett and welcome to this week's Top 5. So I was watching the movie You're Next last night when I was supposed to be coming up with the theme for this week's Top 5. I ended up falling asleep and spilling Doritos all over myself. I woke up about 25 minutes ago and I had a thought. Masks? They're pretty cool. And then I had another thought after that. I still don't have a theme for today's Top 5. Long story short, we're going to be taking a look at some of my very favorite masked movie characters of all time. So, I'm going to be leaving some of the bigger, more obvious masked characters off of this list. So, sorry Darth Vader. Sorry, middle-aged looking high school student Peter Parker. Before Anonymous had to come in and ruin it. The Guy Fox mask was, well, pretty awesome. And Hugo Weaving rocked the hell out of that thing in 2005's V for Vendetta. The only thing that you and I have in common, Mr. Creedy, is we're both about to die. How do you imagine that's gonna happen? With my hands around your neck. I am the law. That was, that was intimidating, right? No, it sucked. Okay, fine. I'm gonna leave the cheesy one-liners up to our number four spot, Judge Dredd. I'm wondering when you'd remember you left your helmet behind. Sir, a helmet can interfere with my psychic abilities. I think a bullet might interfere with some more. You know you've got a great movie mask when you make just as much money selling the mask as a Halloween costume as you do on the franchise itself. Yo. What's up? So you've got a Nazi as the bad guy in your movie. Been there, done that. So how do you freshen things up and make this guy's list? Well, I'll tell you, you make him a 107-year-old Nazi who's conducted dozens of experiments on himself and is now more machine than man. Well, that brings us down to our number one spot, which deservingly goes to Chris O'Donnell's mesmerizing performance in 1997's Batman and Robin. That's not my number one pick. Sorry to disappoint anybody who thought it was. Storm, stop messing with the scripts. Anyway, my real number one goes to, well, none other than the mask itself. Take a look. Hit it. Well, that's it for this week's top five. I'm Benjamin Garrett, and I'll see you next time. Oh, okay, I can't, I can't see. I don't know where I'm...